Sure, sure. Have fun. But me, that's why. I, if I, I somehow manage to come across enough money, I would try to do a Gideon Jura cosplay. Because you see all this hair. Gideon Jura, long hair. Um, he's not the tallest guy in the world. I'm not anywhere near the tallest guy. But I'd like to do something like that. The sharp jaw. I have to get the armor. I, I would want to yeah, do that's, the that's, 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 Yeah, that's the whole point. I'm yeah. uh, roll or paper Oh, yeah, yeah. 16. Okay. So nobody has beaten me on the roll of the deck. This is... This is weird. Um, I don't know what to do with myself. Oh. So, that's awkward. This is an awkward hand. The one land I don't want in my opener. And then... But I can, I can play from there, is the trick. You know what, I'll keep. Yeah, if I, if I say something like that, that kind of lets you know. Oh. Um, See, my problem is, like, if I, if I was to, like, there's no really good fat anime characters. I, I want to say there are, but I'm there having are. a brain blank right now. There, there are, like, no, there are some. Yeah. Uh, but, like, there's, like, one, I was like, I don't want to dress up as him. Because the guy has a belly button, the anime character has his belly button shooting the entire time. And I'm sorry, but my belly button is not the most attractive, the cutest right, thing in the world. Here we go, here we go. And, okay, that was, a, that was good. That was good. I think if I just keep a one, my one land is the one tapped land in the deck. Um, and so I, I don't think I would have done very well with that. It just time walk you, basically. Time walk, give you a turn. Time walk me, I guess is the way to put it. Oh, it would not have worked very well at all. I imagine. Give me way too much time to get out of the game. But as if it wasn't bad enough for me before, here's six. I didn't have to mulligan too much today. That's odd by me. I've had a mulligan a couple. It's like. It's like, as, as, like, as okay. you start to get like, the, the fetches and the shock you need. Shocks you need to mulligan. At least I don't mulligan as much. That's fair. That's fair. Yeah. I'll keep and... Hmm. I guess it's tough. Yeah. Yeah. Can I go to 17 here? I expect a lot of that. No. It's like, like, when you're playing Zoo, it's like, even if I'm just tossing out like a Kearney or something, I often just go, like, my, my life was off at 17. <laughs> oh my god. Yes. Trigger? Okay, mind sensor. Got it. No, I can take two. I can take two. Yeah, and that's it. Here we go. I wonder what that draw is. Um. I, I am not a big fan of Goblin Guide. Oh, Poor guy. <laughs> Shock. Yeah? 16. And I'll pass. I like Goblin Guide. I'll, but, but, I'll have you playing with him, not against him. Hmm. Fair. All the dust fires, this is what I need to do against the zoo deck. Rock myself down to no life. Already. <laughs> I'm winning. Yes, you are. Okay, blood crit, blood crit. I have a swift spear. Okay. And I'm going to lava spike you. Can I respond to yes. the prowl trigger? Yes. So spike, the prowl trigger. Jar. Entropic jar. We're going to bolt and respond to the prowl trigger. Bolt on Swissier? Yes. Okay. Alright, so I'll take three. Combat? Whee! Trigger. Oh no! It's a basic! Uh, I'm going to play that. Yes. Does it? Yeah. Okay. Gut shot. No. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Why <laughs> why? That's how Greg said. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, do you mind me? doesn't work. It doesn't work unless you yell at us. Go. Um, oh, it's fine. I'm not like five. What's up? Give me a. I'll sleep with you. What's up? 
<laughs> First one's not the shirt. Yep. Smiter. Smiter. Oh, oh God. God. Path? Path. Yep. Yep. <laughs> you know what <laughs> That's what I am trying to be more mindful of my play. Yeah, that was, that was the correct sequence. You got that absolutely right. I'm trying to get into more competitive magic, so I'm trying to be more mindful of my play instead of taking shortcuts for things. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. <laughs> Which is why I actually play out my fetch lands and tap. Okay. I agree. Um, I gotta get past turn. I have to get tighter on my Aether Vile Trigger. I yeah. feel like I missed, on, I missed on a couple today, but a couple can mean a big difference. Very good, basically. Oh boy. He's a big one. Say hi, buddy. <laughs> That's the thing, right? Past turn? Pass. Sack like a creature, there's a life. That was. I feel like such a liar. Oh, that's such a thing I'm going to have to deal with now. Most time it is. Oh You're right. God. You're right. So, you know, that's yeah, I'll play more like basics. Bump. Sure, I'll lose three. Last turn. I already... Actually, he doesn't have any monsters in the field. How much like it? In the cattle. 3 3? It is. Pass. Yeah. Yeah. It's 47. Skull crack you didn't turn? 4. <laughs> okay, so no helix. Sorry. Maybe. Yeah, that's exactly the game. Pass turn. Yeah. And a turn. Yeah. Nine sensor. After it resolves, end of turn. Searing blood. Deal you three. One. Pass turn. <laughs> I, I wouldn't have had that information without the goblin guide, so okay, okay. I shouldn't give it quite so much of a hard time. That's against the rules. So you can or have. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Upkeep. Gets verdict. Lose a life. I was trying to think if I can get around, if I can get around it by getting rid of my creatures. I was waiting for that helix to just blow me out right there. <laughs> He didn't do it in the snow crack. It's somewhere. Alright, see you in a bit. Why? Bigger than blue. You can splash, just have a few <laughs> blue shock lands in your deck for treasure cruise. You can't do that so easily for dig through time. And also, Delver does not like blue blue. Delver does not, yeah. The kinds of Delver decks that were running treasure cruise, the like burn style Delver decks, yeah. do not want to come across blue blue. There were essentially a blue splash, more or less. Well, they, I guess I had some of that or my hand, stuff like that, but none of their stuff was double blue. It, I guess the fear is that it might make control a little too good, but it went, they certainly wouldn't go in the same decks. Okay. Certainly. I'll keep. Likewise. Yes. Same life. Just, Just the one? No more shock. Oh, yeah. Okay, 17. Oh, my goodness. Of course, they're always on top of each other. Aha. Uh -huh. The only two in the deck. I had to laugh at that. I always find it funny when I'm like, you know, I'm playing against Mill, they go, I'm going to ghost quarter your stomach grounds, I'm going to search up the Australian stomach grounds, and can do it. And there's oh, only one in the deck. Oh, jeez. Only one more in the deck. Yeah, it doesn't seem like that would be the way you would play it, because Kurde, but it, it makes sense when you know the rest of your deck. There's red card in the deck, but... Sure, sure, yeah. You got Wild in the Coddle turn one, though? The cattle. It has to be the card eight. I actually got Wild in the Coddle turn one. Oh, look at that! It doesn't happen that often. It's like, it's weird. It's always eight. It's always yeah, it's eight. always eight. <laughs> actually, I'm probably fine with against this deck. I really, I'm, 
I almost rather turn one a Curde than a turn one of a Violent Cobble. Because Curde, Curde actually blocks Goblin Guide. All about to swap, about to swap, go shuffle. <laughs> I'm all, okay, bump. Bump him up. That's it? How much does bump cost a flashback? Six. Oh, okay, oh, okay, okay, a lot yeah. more than I thought we're it was. We're not anywhere near Never mind. That. Okay, uh, I, thought, I'm I thought it was like two. It's not just the wind, it's not all in your head, and it's definitely something to worry about. Um, love the flavor text of this card. Three, yep, three. It's a three, three. Three. Ow. <laughs> This beer? Bump? Response to bump. Okay. Well, or the prowess trigger on Swiss beer. Either way. Or whatever. <laughs> he looks targeting Swiss beer. Okay. Game three, lose three. That's right. <laughs> Last turn. Eee. Oh, okay. Insert blowout here. Three. Eee. Okay. Shock Stinger Foundry taps. Yes. Yep. It's actually a very good hand against Burn. Yeah, you're not kidding. You're gonna ride the wild and cobble train, huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if it works. Yeah. And it's working. Yeah. They were not it happens more often than you would think. Yeah, just one this time. Yeah. I was still debating it, but I think I'm just gonna do one. Well, nope, we're going to seven. This is going to hurt. <laughs> but I think this is the right play here. In the rift bolt, past turn. Is it your turn? Yes. He looks like a fire magic. Woo! Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. I got you, dude. Yeah, sorry about that. Yeah, the other play was bolt the wild Nicole. the cattle. <laughs> Three. Just three? Yep. Alright. Seeing the Kessig made me wonder. We made a four? It's only Avenger? Yeah. <laughs> Minus two. Put me to one? Put you to twenty? Yep. Twenty to one. <laughs> Get out. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> yep. If I go down, I'm gonna go down on my own terms. <laughs> Attack? Yes. Pass turn. Okay, I would need the most ridiculous run yep, of yep, lands yep. <laughs> for this to work. I'm gonna do it though because if it happens on camera. Pass. Okay. Oh, okay. Down to zero. Greatness at any cost. You gotta try. I jinxed it. I said, you know yeah, what? If it, it happens on camera, you know, it, it therefore it cannot happen on camera. I'll be on the play this time around. Yeah, sure. <laughs> so that's about our decks. It really does matter who's on the play and who's on your all. Fair. Oh, yeah. Coddle taking it down. 
It does that. With a little help from the Johnny Vengeance, I guess. Yeah, it feels a little like Delver when you play it that way. It's yeah. it's a three power creature you just keep protecting, and it gets there. It doesn't have flying, but you know, it doesn't for protect, protect as much as clear path. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I imagine that Delver's the one that oh, I know that's in there. <laughs> Delver's the one that's like flying over your defenses, and Bob Nicobles just bashing through them. Yeah. The only thing is a light one because it's, like, it's easier to make it a 3 3 than it is. It is. It's, what is a Nakadu? It's, it's a cat. <laughs> oh, so, okay. like, a, when it's an animal, they call it a cat or whatever okay. specific type okay. of cat. When it becomes sentient, they oh, call okay. it a coddle. So, okay. like, elephants in magic are loxodons when they're. Oh, okay, I got gotcha. it. sentient. Yeah. Gotcha. That's all. Makes sense. Um, well, thanks. Oh, no, no, no. Lox yeah, loxodons are elephants and the loxes are rhinos. What were you about to say? Well, I have to, I have to, I'm just saying I have, to, I have to look at the Latin, Latin, Latin term for it. Oh, yeah, that's. Because okay. I think Latin an elephant will. Oh. It's like, it's like locks or something for elephant in, in Latin. Okay, I didn't know that. It's been too long since- I actually don't think I ever learned the word for elephant in my Latin like, classes. I'm, well, some like barely- uh, <laughs> I, I never took Latin, but there's certain things I just know, like... Sure, yeah. Bear, Ursa- Okay. Or, Ursa Major well, Minor. Yeah. yeah, well, well, my dad's a scientist, so... That'll do it, yeah. When I was young, like, I used to read all these little, um, like, animal books and stuff like that about different animals. Okay. Go out, we'll go out in the woods, go see if we can catch <laughs> animals, you know, set trap. You'll set these little, little traps cool. that never worked. That's pretty cool. That's one way to enjoy nature. Yeah. <laughs> they never worked. Um, <laughs> oh, my dad, my, my, my dad got pissed when he... Because <laughs> we kept digging holes in his yard. <laughs> I'm oh, man. Okay. Out, like, when you're a kid and, like, your dad's a shovel, <laughs> man, like, what are you going to do all day? <laughs> Dig a hole. <laughs> exactly. That's what we did. We dug a hole. Just dug and, a hole. and then we like try to put like cut like put, like put like leaves and stuff. And your dad's on the lawnmower one day. That's <laughs> <laughs> on the lawnmower. He goes in the hole. I'm imagining like how big this hole is. Yeah. This is like um, just a little. Yeah. This is, this is a divot. This is, a divot. <laughs> this is yeah. enough to. Or is this like you just you, you had nothing to do but dig until you built the Grand Canyon or something. <laughs> No, this is like more like this is like more like one of the it's like one of those holes where um if you ever like cut down like a dog you know what a dogwood tree is you know what they usually get? Yeah. Oh yeah. It was like let's say you cut down a dogwood tree and you burn the stump down. So then you got then you took the stump out. It's deep enough to where it can cause some damage. <laughs> yeah. It's not the big biggest hole in the world, but <laughs> oh, yeah. it's but yeah if you fall in it you can you can get pretty upset. Right, here we go. I'll keep. Okay. So I'm gonna let you if you ever done anything like that, Andrew. No. You didn't so go to fire in my dad's backyard one time when I was little. Yeah. We didn't do that. On his brand new sod, he was very wasn't very happy about that. <laughs> <laughs> he just like sod light like to like, you know, like a couple months before that. Yeah. Just burn it all up. <laughs> My big thing was just finding trees to climb. You know? There you go. Well, yeah. I wasn't a very good climber. I've never, I've never been. I was never a very good climber. But I'll go back in the woods. I'll get. I'll. I'll, have, I'll grab my dad's <laughs> like, hatchet or axe, and I'll just cut it. Cut and crap. It down. <laughs> you go. Yeah. <clears throat> Where do you live at, Nicholson? Um. Well, sorry. Uh, technically, it's not. Nicholson. <laughs> yeah, no, you might want to hold on a second. <laughs> I <don't know. laughs> That's what I Okay, you, technically it's not Nicholson. It's um, I, it's technically Hall, but it's like okay. You, do you know where um, Seagrass Lake is? Yeah, I like running Seagrass Lake. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, it's all good. Right. Okay. But yeah, but if you know where Seagrass Lake is, what are you I like pretty much, I will pretty much live right next to Seagrass Lake. Um, I'll, I'll play Foothills. That's it. Yeah, well, uh, so that's it. Okay. Three to your face. Oh, the roof pole. Okay, sure. Yeah. yeah. It wouldn't change the play if I knew it was there. There you go. Catch. Whee! See. Uh, you do try to be mindful of what your life total is at, though. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. So I, I made a misplay earlier today by. Uh, my opponent was at one. But he, the die was not adjusted. I think it was like double bolts. 
throw it thrown at him. And I, so it still said seven. Yeah. And I thought he was at seven, so instead of killing him on the spot, <laughs> I suspended a Rift Bolt, which would have done, it had I not suspended, would have done it, and then played a creature. And he's like, ah, But the, the creature was also Ivor so he was, he was kind of, you know, dead if you do, dead if you don't. Huh. So. Well, it's that you, sometimes you just forget that you can actually cast Rift Bolt. That too, but in this case, mine was not seeing his life total. He was one of those, he didn't adjust his total on his own. He didn't adjust yeah. the die, he did a pen and paper. It cost two to cast, is that right? Uh, three, actually. Three to cast, and you can spend it for one. Mm -hmm. okay. Draw for turn out. Dark Confidant's least favorite lightning bolts. <laughs> um, you know what? He looks your own Pyromancer. So dead. And I just dropped a card. Oh well. Oops. I'm trying not to look down. That's, you know, it's a card you know. Well, okay. <clears throat> uh, I'm ready to go when you are. Yeah, I'm just, I'm loading. That's on my computer. I, I, I used to have an oil crack computer that, when I get, like, so I used to work for your J-Chicken Farm. Yeah. I'll get home from work. Immediately turn my computer on. Then I'll go shower, clean up, get ready. Get, din get dinner made. Pass turn? And then once all that was done, then the computer would be ready, to, we would be on and mm -hmm. ready to go. It's like the old 95 we used to have <laughs> way back when. Yeah. Uh, I still use one of those keyboards. I like it better. This is all loud. Forest. Okay. Hi, Smiter. Kill it. Kill it with fire. Yeah, what can you do? Pyromancer? Sure. Bump you? Sure. Sleeves around here somewhere. These in the back. Okay, hey, bud. And uh, pass turn. There we go. Which is what I've been using. That's a okay. fair amount of glare. Ugh. Hi, Pride Mage. Dragon's Claw. Yep. That seems good. Yep. Hey, Chris. Bob. Bob's good. Pastor? Yeah. Hey, hey, Chris. What time does this place close? Seven. You might, yep. you might want to cut the sign off then. Yeah, All right. Five. Just making sure you know you, so that way people yeah, yeah. Start, so I'll start walking in the store. Thanks for reminding me, guys. <laughs> okay, Bob. Well, that's going to be a toughie. That is in my sideboard still. <laughs> so, actually, swing for three. Chump? Sure. That went under tapped. And then, tap for red, green, and white, because they yeah. can. Hi, Smitey. You're a big one. Yes. Take zero. Yay. Pass turn. Young Pyromancer may not be one, but he feels like an invitational card, doesn't he? Mm. <laughs> it does. Five? 
I'm gonna skull crack you. Sure. Take three. Yep. Block with the token. Sure, and also I gain one. Yes. Oh. It, 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 it says in response, yeah. Yeah. So. I got my work cut out for me. Land for turn? Yes. Well, at least I'm not mono red. <sighs> That's so much consolation right now, though. Best yes. turn? Take three. Yeah, that does me a lot of good now. <laughs> yep. Go ahead and cast it. I'll gain a life. This is not the time you have. Okay. See, so that's why I play a so many basics. That's right. Okay. I'll bring in Blood Moon against the Zoo deck. Nope. It's, it's, it's good if you get down exactly turn three. Because then I actually have to draw my basics. <laughs> <laughs> but right now I have a feeling Blood Moon, Blood Moon may or may not hurt me. Like, hurt me more than it does me. Because I only see one basic swamp. And if he needs green for anything, he'll be in trouble. Last turn. So, actually, let's get this right. Sure. So that people look at us move out. <laughs> oh, it's all good, dude. Swing with the team. Okay, so we're gonna start off with Geth's verdict. Sack a creature, lose a life. He's at least born. Okay. And then we're going to skull crack you. Go to 11. Yeah, 14, then go. Yeah. <laughs> now let's see. I don't want to do this. Okay. One card left. Yep. Pass turn? Yeah. Oh, yeah, nothing in your. Yardless. I'm hellbent. Okay, taking zero again. I'm going to do it. Yeah. Flashback bump in the night. It's been eight. Yeah. Four. Now I'm in trouble. Pass turn. One blocker. One blocker. <laughs> yeah. If that blood moon had been what I wanted it to be, it's still what it, what I decided out for. Still wouldn't have made a difference. <clears throat> Ten. <coughs> Second man. Oh, it's not the sensor. Okay. Loom lion. Okay, there you are, buddy. Pass turn. I got tired of playing four card ace. <laughs> but technically I'm still playing four card ace. <laughs> Ooh, double bob. Okay. So I know one's a bob, one's a blood moon. And I've only seen lands off the draw, so I'm, I'm, I'm still... I'm, I'm, there's one card I do not know. What could it be? Bad check again. I don't think I have any more bombs in there. I do not.
Taylor Swift beer? Yep. Double the bob, double the fun. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that does essentially nothing here. <laughs> Blood Moon, essentially nothing. Yeah, it does. No, it gains you one life. That's <laughs> true. Uh, pass turn. Yeah. What do you say? Curday, okay. He'll be swinging. Pass. That is smart. That is, that is smart. <laughs> okay. Come on, flip Tasker. <laughs> <laughs> Take two. <laughs> Take one. Just letting me kill myself over here. <laughs> Stop hitting yourself. Stop hitting yourself. <laughs> Well, the fact is, it can do damage to me, but if you cast anything, I gain life. <laughs> Time for math. <laughs> Time for math. <laughs> now, I've already lost so I'll, I'll lose so many games because I attack when I, should, when I shouldn't. No cards in hand? You're hellbent? I'm hellbent. Cast I off, then cast a lot of spells. Sorry. If he does have a tasker in his deck, I'll, if he flips it off the bottom, I'll win. There's a few combinations of the bottom. Could be good. Griff Ball plus any two drop. Now, if that was a lightning bolt instead of a lava spike, you'd be a whole lot better off. Okay, Swiss Spear. Yep, on the six. Blood Moon, Love a Spike. I'm on his hand. Spike you? Go to four? Yeah. It's a game one, go seven, go four, okay. So close. So <laughs> close. <laughs> I'm not quite there yet, though. See, so, so, if I draw a board claim and an attack with my creatures, he used, used to block everything. I put everything on the front of one creature. And I have to also know that you have in your hand to <laughs> know to block all on one creature. Well, it doesn't matter, you just hit use another creature anyway. Yeah, so I, I swim with everything, then you know, then it's like, oh. I don't know when the boss with the least toughest round down there. Eidolon. Sure. Pass turn. Okay. Just to disincentivize you casting anything, like, I don't know, Path to Exile. I also need to survive two bob flips, <laughs> which is a real thing. 
Drum roll. Ah! Three. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna do it now. Okay, oh. good God. Okay, so I'm at two. <laughs> I'm at two. <laughs> I'm just gonna. I'm not even gonna adjust. I'm just gonna do it now in case I don't need to. So one. So he has two blood moons in hand and a lot of, and, one, and, a, and, and a land. This is looking really bad right now. Really bad blood moon. There's only like one card <laughs> I do not know, and the fact is he's got idol on on the field. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's true. He does. <laughs> um, so I can't cast Jack. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I can play that, but whatever. Combat. Okay. Whee! Okay. So you can't cast anything without <laughs> killing you first. Yes. So the one, 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 one. That's four. So it means we have to block everything with two power. Both bobs. Well, actually, no. let's see. If I block that, I, that puts me to one. Yes. Congrats, you can do math. However, I'm going to pretend I can't and go to zero. Good <laughs> job, good job. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Next card. That Dragon Claw, man. That Four. Dragon Claw. And then I got to burn my sleeves split. You definitely did it correctly by leaving both bobs out like that. <laughs> That's a little too much velocity. Um, so the Blood Moons were going out for Searing Blood? I believe Searing, yeah, Blood, not Blaze. Mm. Because so many of your creatures have three toughness. Yeah, and that's, it, that's although it doesn't and I sign out the ones that do have two. Have, 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 uh, only two creatures that have three toughness is... Yeah. Um, Neither Royal Quarry and then Mind Sensor. But if that had been a Searing Blood instead, then I would have revealed it off Bob and been at three life. I could cast the Goblin Guy, beat go to one, and then I'd have you at Exaxes. Um, but that's that's neither here nor there. I think it was still the right thing to take the bloods out because they hit so little in your deck. Yes. <laughs> and Blood Moon early enough can do something. But again, your your deck is set correctly to fight against Blood Moon. You just happened to bob both. <laughs> yeah, I happened to bob both Blood Moons. <laughs> Way late too. Um, other other cards that came in. There was one other a multi. Well, the cards that came out for me. This. One boss charm, two mind sensors. Respectful. Okay. Absolutely. Yeah, I'm not doing other than my fetch lands. I'm not really searching. And we brought in a dragon's claw and two talons. Yeah. I think if I had them, I'd also sign out lava mancers.